Hi friends, today will be a razor long information video in which we will try to understand what awaits Project Hive after the listing in the future. So let's start the review. First, let's remember what this game is. This is a play to earn a role playing game developed on Solana in which you play as one character robot with other players. The game contains NFT that you can use in battle and buy and sell. Project Hive is famous for its excellent and realistic graphics. So, as we said in previous videos, this is a fantastic game with realistic graphics, cool gameplay and a lot of benefits. I am sure that if the project is unique among other projects, then it uh, has the right to life. What are the unique features of Project Hive? If we consider the gameplay, we have three game options. This is combination of uh, play to earn, uh, win to earn, where you have complete uh, daily tasks and fight against other members in-game currency, PvA storyline where you go through story chapters and large scale, and PvP where you play uh, in the clan and try to capture all the section. That is, we see that the project has various possibilities in the game. Players will definitely not be bored and they will always find something to their liking. Let's go further, earnings are one of the most important features that players pay attention to. It should be significant so that our every action is rewarded. In Project High we can play territory wars where we fight uh, for a big pool, PvA uh, duels where we can earn money every day and uh, PvP duels. You can also create your clan and get rewards for it and trade valuable NFTs on the marketplace and earn accordingly on the price difference. As we can see there are many opportunities for earnings. Uh, but exactly how much we will be able to earn while this information is a secret. The team uh, is an equally important component for the success of the project. We know that the project is staffed by real professionals with worth experience, in particular in such uh, companies as Netflix, Red Bull, Nissan, Inter, HyperX, Marvel, Microsoft and others. As it is, now you understand how powerful the people are, how are able to create a mega game. If you consider tokenomics, we have two tokens, uh, the HGT token and IGT. IGT is control token and the IGT in-game token. Uh, they will be burned and used in mass in the game, both tokens idea for release in quartal. For 2022, RTT tokens is a little earlier than IGT. Everything is clear about the distribution and distribution of the total supply as we talked about in my previous video. The layers are linear and correct but there are some minor nuances. Now we move on to the listing uh, itself. Uh, recently the Project Hive team announced the news that they still plan um, to move IDO. A date was chosen and a decision was made. This is October or November 2022, also accordingly to premium information, IDO was planned to be held at the end of September. Change the data because Project Hive wants to get the maximum profit and success from the IGT uh, token listing. Therefore, it uh, the best to get the token after the official release of the game. After the official release of the game, it will be possible to download as the official version of the game on both Windows and Android. That is, a large number of players uh, will be able to test the game and that's cool. At the moment the number of registration in play market uh, reached 75,000 uh, participants in 2 weeks or 3 weeks and we don't yet take into account the number of people who will test the game on Windows. That is, by the end of October, that is, before IDO itself, you will have at least uh, uh, two, uh, 200 or 300,000 participants and more, possibly many times more, who are already testing the game. Accordingly, those who like it will want to buy RGT tokens and there will be a big hype before the listing. Perhaps a large number of people will buy back tokens and we will see the price which will grow strongly within a few days. Uh, this is a big plus for the game itself and for the players. As we know, for any play to earn games, the players are the most important. At this point, you already have enough hype around this game to help Project Hype continue as a project and build a future with this audience. 
after a powerful IDO you can expect an influx of audiences and increase in popularity, which will only have a positive effect on the game. The more players play, the more tokens I use and the better for the project. This is uh, the best. In my opinion, Project Hack has a good future, it is great. Uh, team building a great product with wide gameplay and good earrings. If you look at 95% uh, of play to earn games, you won't find cool graphics uh, that are even close to Project Hive. This is already a significant plus in the piggy bank. The ability to earn in many battles is also a good advantage among others. That is, we have a truly unique game that supposes its competitors in almost all aspects expect for investments. I am sure that after the listing of Project Hire, but no, after the official release, more and more new users will test this game and stay ahead to earn money. And uh, at the time of IDO, will have great popularity and hype that will help the project grow in value and gain a foothold in the play to earn games market. So, friends, my word is positive. I believe in the future of Project Hive, and I am sure that this game will enter the top 10 best play to earn games.